Hey, this is John Brantley Cole Jr. and you are watching my first video blog of this series. Basically what I'm doing is I am going to start a series here. Uh, right now I am in my dressing room for Young and the Restless on CBS. Uh, I have a two day shoot here and I play a technician who is testing out DNAs of these two women who uh, were trying to figure out who is the rightful daughter of this very big family. Um, fun shoot i'm in my dressing room oh my dressing room here we go here it is it's just basic just a couch chair table and a tv with a dvd player closet um it's like a little studio apartment without the kitchen basically but i'm hanging out here it's i'm at the cbs studios in on beverly between beverly and melrose uh, Avenue and it's the same studio as the Price is Right which is really cool because a whole bunch of crazy old people in the front with crazy t-shirts as I was walking in and I got to see a whole bunch of the sets and stuff because we're on the same actual set as these guys um, but oh today my no yesterday sorry yesterday my agent called me and said I had a meeting with the producers of a show called Chuck for on NBC and uh, it was for today but unfortunately, I can't make it because I'm on set of Young and the Restless. And uh, I do want, I, you know, I'm not going to turn down doing Young and the Restless, but I uh, would have wanted to go meet the guys at Chuck. Because it's very rare you get to go straight to producers uh, for a role. A lot of times is the actors have to audition for a casting director, and then they weed out the people uh, uh, that are bad or not right for the role, and then they send the people that they think are right straight to the producer. So for whatever reason, either the casting director likes my work and trusts me and sends me and wants to send me straight to producers, or the producers know me somehow or know my work and they wanted to just see me directly. So it was, you know, pretty sad to 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 say that I couldn't make it, and we couldn't make it work because I'm on set for the next two days. So who knows when I'm going to be out here? Um, other than that, I know this is pretty boring. <sighs> On a side note, look what Young and the Restless put in my dressing room. They gave me a pillow, I guess for sleeping, and slippers. I have no idea why. Um, and it's kind of gross to think about the other people whose feet have been in this too. So I'm probably not gonna use this. But sentiment, you know, was nice, right? I can have slippers to walk around in if I want to walk around in slippers. So I'm in my car right now and I just finished day one of Young and the Restless, which was really cool, fun, and everything. Uh, but I got out a little bit earlier than I thought, and so I thought maybe I could make the uh, meeting with the producers for Chuck uh, at Warner Brothers. So I called my agent and said, you know, uh, are they still seeing people? And he says, if you can get there in 30 minutes, um, I can't. I'm stuck in traffic, and I'm not going to be able to go. So, uh, I really wanted to go. I really wanted to meet them and audition for the role and, and establish, you know, more credit and more money. But, oh well, there you go. I'm not going to make it. So I'm just going to go home, enjoy my day, and then get ready for day two of Young and the Restless. Ah! Hey guys, it is day two of my Young and the Restless shoot. It is 8 a.m. Um, I actually had my call here was 8 a.m. And I just finished going into makeup. So this is as good as it's going to get. Um, I had to wake up at 6 a.m. Because of rush hour traffic and getting here and blah, blah, blah. Oh, man. Uh, um, but um, I'm here. Day one was cool. I got to shoot two scenes and... Um, the ladies were very, very, very nice, and I get to shoot with a different lady today. Uh, I didn't have, I don't have the pleasure of watching the show, so um, I think it's on too early <laughs> for me. But um, anyway, uh, I'm just here. I should learn my lines. I should be in and out pretty quickly. Uh, what's crazy is on the television they have regular channels, but also there's these special channels that you can watch. And one of the channels is, let me see if I can show you. Uh, put my food down. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but that is a camera that is set outside the studio overlooking the front gate. 
there you go, so people can come in and out, and uh, overlooking the mountains uh, and everything. I never realized how nice this looks. But, um, and there is another channel that is basically, let me fix this, is basically, um, I guess, the show channel which means that we can watch rehearsals, we can watch what they're taping, so if they're taping other scenes, I can watch it, uh, see people mess up, people, you know, do whatever. Uh, it's kind of cool. So when I leave here, people can watch me taping, because I'll be on set taping. Um, Joe Isuzu, I don't know if you know who that guy is, the guy who did those Isuzu commercials is on the show, and he just got engaged to one of the cast members I was doing a scene with, and she's running around the set with her diamond ring showing everybody, because I guess she's in um, puppy love stages, uh, even though they're like 80 million years old. Uh, but they're cool. They're very, very cool. Um, uh, other than that, I have to put on a suit to get into the scene, but I have a good hour just to hang out. Uh, Boring. Hey guys, I'm in. I'm getting ready for uh, my scene. I have to wear a suit in it, but I wanted to let you guys know that I'm missing another audition, being on set on day two of Young and the Restless. Uh, my agents called me yesterday, and I have an audition for a commercial that's only being played in San Diego. Um, and the catch is, I have to go to San Diego for the audition. Uh, I told them I'm on set, and depending when I get out, I may or may not uh, be able to go. But it looks like I'm not going to because they're only seeing people before um, a certain time and there's no, it's a two hour drive from Hollywood. So, uh, and I'm not even in Hollywood, I'm right next, I'm in Melrose area at CBS Studios. But um, um, I missed two auditions. Uh, yesterday was the producers for Chuck and today is the commercial for San Diego. Um, I'm sad, but I'm not regretting it because, you know, I like being on Young and the Restless. So, uh, other than that, I just hope after I'm done here, because I only have two days shoot here, uh, after I'm done here I'll still have more opportunities, because usually what happens is they all come at once, all at the same time, and then you get this huge dry spell, you know, or at least for me it happens. Uh, other people should be luckier. But anyway, just want to let you know. Ah! Hey guys, I just wanted to show you the television real quick. It looks like they are shooting something downstairs, so I get to watch, which is very cool. I think it's very interesting. I don't know if there's any sound yet. No, because they're not shooting. But we get to see, you know, the actors and the, the techs and the director and everything down there, um, which is kind of cool. I'm done. I finished shooting my last scene, which was totally cool. Um, everyone was cool on the set. Uh, I looked all spiffy, like I was, um, I think the show takes place in Connecticut. But I'm done, and call it a day. Uh, I hope you guys are somewhat interested or, or entertained by my video blog. No, 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 no. So I would love you guys to subscribe to the series. Uh, I'll be putting more on in the future. And I would love to have your comments, your suggestions, what you think. Uh, let me know, because I would love your feedback. All right? So, this is John Brantley Cole. Till next time.